What's up Unrulies? It's your boy Unruly J with Unruly Vlogs and I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Just waking up, I have a eye appointment. I also have the uh, spinal and tissue, doc tissue doctor again, um, Dr. Andrew, to work on that neck, the shoulder area. And we're also gonna try and make it down to uh, my compadre's house so we can make some conk salad. So I don't know what's how the day's gonna plan out. But I'm getting ready to get up and get ready. I'm gonna jump in the Z. I think I'm gonna take the Z out today. So I'm gonna jump in the Z, head on down, burn a full tank of gas just to go run a few errands. We know how that goes. All right, got out the shower. Um, feeling super fresh and clean. And I gotta get the big red, big sexy red out the garage, warmed up and off to my appointments I go. Let me go ahead and eat breakfast because uh, time is starting to tick. So let's get this uh, show on the road. All right, it's time to go. Let's get this. this or anything nope I just came out of the eye doctor god Lee and they gave me these to put by my glass because they dilated my eyes <laughs> I don't know why I told them to go ahead and do that knowing I got other things I got to take care of today but guess what it don't matter whatever we still gonna figure it out we still gonna do what we got to do today without any fuss just got to make it work see See that? Let's do that nice and do that again. On the drive home, uh, I'm probably gonna be in the right lane, hazards on, driving very slow. Look at this. Got a wide body. What is the HE stands for? Y'all Dodge owners, I don't know. Mopar. What does HE stands for? He's got a wide body. I don't think it's a Hellcat. I don't know. Yo, this dilation to my eye. Man, this thing is rough. It's got me like... Dang, I made it a little bit early. This car surprises me, you know, every time. Maybe because of that. Who knows? No, I'm kidding. I don't remember the last time I used that thing. It's there for show now. Last time I went to the track in one video posted. That's probably the last time I actually used nitrous. Other than that, I don't use it. But yeah, yo, this thing needs to wear out ASAP my eyes, cause damn, everything's blurry. Like, well, the light, as soon as the light hit my eye, it's, it's donezo. But then when I put them little things on, you know, it makes it easier. But I'm not going inside this damn place with those things on. I'm look goofy as shit. So yeah, nah, we ain't doing that. So I'm about to thug it out, go in here, get this done, and I'll holla at y'all. Alright guys, so I actually finished up um, there with Dr. Andrew. And let me tell you, man, once again, got me right. He got me right. He put that little static machine on my neck and stuff. And yeah, I think that did the trick. My motion and mobility in my my shoulder and neck way better way better so I'm not fighting with that you know pain anymore or anything like that I've um, got a few more visits and then we're calling it a wrap but I think I'm gonna keep him around for for a hot minute I think I'm gonna start using him just on you know sporadic and random things uh, because whenever I have like pain anywhere in my back neck or whatever it seems like as soon as he freaking gets to doing what he does pain goes away first shot so yeah that's that and time to head to the crib man how about look at this look at the Z look at the Z guys it was perfectly clean it was perfectly clean until I Decided to take it to my doctor appointment. Man, this weather is looking disgusting. 
get this stuff out of the freezer. Still prepped to head down to Compadre's house. Probably gonna be a little bit. Let's see if the rain cools down a little bit. God dang. Oh my God. Whoa. Yo, look. Already getting the murk all soaked. All right, well, let me get some stuff out, prepare it to get ready to go to Compadre's house. All right, so I see some fish right here. Cod, there's the conch. The other thing, this is what we're looking for, the fish. So let me get some out for my boy and yeah. Okay, so I got everything put into the car that I needed to put in there already. Everybody's getting ready to follow me out. Whatever, whatever works. Operation, make it down to Compadre's house in one piece. All right, we're here at Compadre's crib. Got to get some stuff out. Sky's still a little gray. I done brought the drone so he can fly it, but I don't know if we're going to be able to do that. So we're going to head inside, have him start thawing the meat, and figure out what we're going to drink or what's what. Damn, look. Specs all fogging up. It's all good, though. So let's go ahead and head inside, because I know he's about to cuss me out. All right, so now it's time to, you know, close up the vlog, the, the, the food, the atmosphere, the vibe, it's always a thing, man. It's always a vibe over at, you know, my compadre and comadre's house. So we ate, I tore it up. Sorry, I didn't give you guys a, a finished visual of the food, but that thing was fire. I'm telling you, which is just like pressure in the cunt, like, you know, putting it in a pressure cooker to soften it up, peel the skin off, and compadre take care of that. Johnny D does his, his thug dizzle chops it up put tomatoes onions and all that man that shit be bussin and he had his fish that he cooked but yeah man today was a successful day so i got my eye appointment taken care of um definitely went to the the spinal and tissue doctor shout out to dr andrew and then chilling with the compadre and comadre so that's all i got for the this vlog man thank you for watching support don't forget to like and subscribe love y'all